A police chase racing through several communities in Trumbull County. A First News viewer pulled out its phone or their phone to get it and then sent us the video. Now it helped us show you, but we already knew it was going on. Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. And I'm Alexis Walters. This all started just before 4 o'clock and new since 5. We have brand new details about how it all started and how it finally ended. First News reporter Lindsay Watson is live in Warren with what she's learned in just the last hour. Well, this is what we've been able to learn from Cortland detectives in the last hour. Bazetta police were helping another agency in an unknown investigation. They asked Cortland officers to try and help them pull over a car on Elm Road. At some point, a Cortland office officer thought that he was hit by the driver. We've learned the name of that driver tonight. It's Juanita Pruitt. So that officer put it in park and Pruitt took off racing through several neighborhoods followed by police. This is the video you're seeing right here. Officers tell us she later sideswiped a deputy's unmarked cruiser on 422 in Warren. Eventually, Pruitt pulled up in front of a house and ran inside. And this is video of where that chase ended tonight near the intersection of Southern and Merriweather. Pruitt was taken into custody, and that SUV she was driving was towed. Police tell us when they ask her why she ran, she said she was scared. It's unclear if she's facing any charges tonight. But that's the latest for now. Reporting live in Warren tonight, Lindsay Watson, WKBN 27 First News.